lights. Ah, Jesus. Camera. Action. But today's theme is movies. Well, whoa, how would you get? That's crazy. You guys, you guys are you're some thinkers. You're little Spielbergs right there. I see you. Looking good. Hi, I hope you're my name is Mr. Fruit, and welcome to Move Doll, Movie Doll, Move Doll, Move Movie Doll. Move. Yeah. Just found out about it, and I said, hey, why the, hey, why the heck is not? You know what I'm saying, brother? Hey, I don't I don't know. It's Wordle, if you know what Wordle is. But it's a movie clip. So, I apparently it gives you a one second clip. One second. You gotta, you gotta watch it and guess it. You can ask for like a longer one, I think, if you get it wrong. But then it's like a marred victory if you end up getting it. Big ol' asterisk. I don't want an asterisk next to my name. Oh, wait, wait. I thought this was Mr. Fruit Plays. Like, video juegos. Well, this is video, <laughs> but it's a moo. Whatever, dude. I don't know. It's a freaking variety, dude. Watch the video. I'm sure you'll like it. And if you don't, feel free to flame me. That's fair. All right, first up. <sighs> Take a big old shot of adrenaline. Just <laughs> this fun fact. When people are like, say like, I thought I saw... Well, it was like everything was in slow motion. It's actually because when you have more adrenaline and stuff, your your brain is actively making more decisions. Sometimes up to like 10 times as many decisions in a second. And so literally your brain's just working overtime. And so it feels like it's going slow motion because you're thinking and, and executing so much more in a small amount of time. Point is, I'm going to need that if I want to figure out what this clip is. I hope it's like an iconic clip. I used to be a bit of a movie buff. We'll get into that. Okay, and go. Ah, uh, okay. Three, two, one. <laughs> oh, that is not, I thought it was going to be, I interpreted it as here is a one second clip, not here is the movie in one second. That was, it was one, thankfully I'm a gamer and I know what it is, it's Juno. Survey says, oh my dude, I told you guys, it was, that was, I saw Elliot Page. Uh, I think I might have seen Michael Sarah. I'm not sure. I've only seen Juno once too, so proud of myself. Here's the thing. It's like Wordle. You're like, okay, cool. So that's the video because that's the... Okay, <laughs> see you guys next episode. No, apparently I can go back to previous days. I've never done this. I just found out about it. So this is fun. We get to, we get to do this together. Play poster doll? There's so many dolls. What is... I'm kind of... What is... The, I'm interested. <laughs> I'm hentai? What am I looking at here? What is this... Ah, uh, okay. I don't actually know. Start. So I have 20. Do I guess what I'm supposed to? What the fudge? I'm supposed it's, it's Sonic. What is a poster for what? I don't know. What is this? You're 20 seconds. It's a movie poster. That, I, I just guessed Sonic because there's a big red bar. What? Okay. Well, let's. I definitely don't know it. Uh, I don't know. Okay. Keep going. A little bit more. A little, a lot more. What if we go the whole way? It's is it supposed to become more? I I got it. I got. I can make out what it, it's not Star Wars, is it? There's no chance. I almost want to say that's Harrison Ford, and that looks like ships. Okay, Sturgle doesn't really work because there's a there's a movie poster formula this seems like a little bit of an older movie but like every poster these days is the exact same it's like main character face other face villain side characters fanfare random effects like space in the background to fill the void video and that's everything literally every movie ever now so i feel like i am so close i still don't know what it is just a little bit. It's Blade Runner. Fudge. I was. It was Harrison Ford. Yeah. Uh, I'm kind of impressed. I I figured out that was Harrison Ford though. Okay. Maybe we'll come back to this. But we're here for Move a Doll, not Poster Doll. Okay. So let's go back. I don't know when you guys are gonna see this. This was June sixth. Gotta stay hydrated. Even though this dehydrates you. <laughs> June fifth. Here we go. Okay. This is way harder than I thought. Three, two. One. Was that Tom Cruise? It looked like there was a diner. Maybe it wasn't Tom Cruise. It wasn't Ferris Bueller's day off, is it? Mm, I'm going to go Ferris Bueller. <sighs> but I'm really not confident. Let's try Ferris Bueller's day off. No. Okay. Two second clip. Here we go. A little slower this time. Because I need it. Bit of a boomer here. It's Top Gun. Ah, it was Tom Cruise. I was... 
I was about to say Tom Cruise, but I was like, nah. and then Top Gun, and I was like, no, 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 it's it's Top Gun. I knew it. I should have stuck to my guns. God. I was almost two for two, man. Dang. Here we go. One second. You know the drill. Focus up. Pay attention. Uh, back from the future. Back for right. Back 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 to the future. Back to the future. Guess what I tell you. I was made for this. This is this is my moment. My moment. And I'm pooping in my half pants. June 3rd. Dude, next? Dude, I didn't realize this was so easy. Also, this is also assuming that I've seen the movies. That kind of helps, too. Because it, it's like with Wordle, there's an extent to where I can eventually... I kind of can guess what a word is, even if I don't entirely know the word. But in this case, if I've never seen the movie, my best guess will be, do I recognize an actor? Okay, what is a movie of theirs that I have not seen? Okay, well, I kind of start off hot. A lot of pressure. Not, not a clue. Not a clue. 50s, 40s movie, 30s maybe? Uh, to be honest, if the movie predates the 70s, the likelihood I've watched it has gone really, it goes way down. And I'm sorry to say that. I have no idea, and I doubt this is right. I'm just saying Citizen Kane, because it was black and white. Yeah, I got, it. we can slow this down, but I don't think. <sighs> Wait, some of that did look iconic. I can't. I'm gonna say Casablanca, but that that doesn't sound right. Look at me. Uh, <laughs> never seen it, but I was gonna say. Wait, I was like, wait, okay. I swear I've seen some of those. Never seen the movie, but like the stills. Okay, a little more recent. Anything 80s plus, and I have a much better shot. Okay, big brain. Here we go, Amogus. Kill Bill. Oh my god, it's so easy. It's so free, dude. Oh my god, how does he do it? Well, I'll tell you how I do I saw Emma Thurman, first off, in her iconic scene. And then I believe it was uh, Lucy Wu, is that her name? Kill Bill's sick, dude. If you haven't seen it, and I'm pretty sure a little movie of trivia for you. It has one of, if not at the time, the longest continuous shot in Hollywood. That might have been volume two, I can't remember. But there's this continuous scene where she's out in this courtyard place in this building and then she goes into the bathroom and then back out into the bathroom there's this whole sequence and it's all one continuous shot. It's sick. In fact, I went to school for movies actually. I wanted to be a director. Uh, and then I realized that's not gonna happen. I knew I was boned when they're like, in this biz, your best bet is networking. And I'm like, all right, well, this little introvert's gonna see himself out because that, I can't think of anything worse than talking to new people I don't know. And that's what, that's like for the requirements. Okay, deuces. Which is also kind of YouTube. Everyone's like, you gotta collab to get bigger. <laughs> no thanks. No, new people. Next. Two, one. Uh, signs. I want to say it's signs. Uh, right? I see dead people. Is that signs? It's Bruce Wells. I saw Bruce Wells, and I swear I saw the... Um, can't remember his name, but the... Yeah, I see dead people. I'm going to say signs. Oh, it's not. I could have sworn that was... Okay, let's do it again. No, it is the movie. Oh, my God. It's just, I remember the... It's not... I remember the movie title wrong. It is it is Bruce Willis, and it is the I See Dead People. It's so stupid because I was talking about this with my wife the other day, this movie, and I said signs, and I was like, but that's not the movie. You know what I'm talking about. And then I didn't bother to remember the actual name, of the, and so it stuck in my head. It's The Sixth Sense. The movie freaked me out. Still does. <sighs> I knew it. It's kind of like Top Gun, except that one I went with my other gut. This one I was literally trying to guess this movie. I just forgot the name of said movie. Edward Scissorhands, or Z either that, or it could have been Zoolander, but I think, I don't know, there was one part in there where it could have been, I think I saw a still of either the runway from Zoolander, did I say Zootopia? I don't even know, um, or I'm pretty sure I saw white-haired Johnny Depp, I'm gonna go Edward Scissorhands, it's not, I don't think it's Zoolander, I think it's Zoolander. Are you kidding me? I just, fudge, man. Same thing, man. Oh, my God. Dang it. I had it there, too. So, I, but, hey, so far, though, we haven't gone past two guesses. But still, 
disappointed in myself. Let's do this. Two, one. Oh, oh, uh, Bill, Billy and Ted's ex. Uh, what's the what's the? F I actually, I've actually never seen it. Bill and Ted's Excellent Adventure. I don't think I know this movie, but I could have sworn I saw it. Keanu Reeves with a bowl cut. I'm not sure. Let me watch it again. I'm pretty sure it is Keanu Reeves. I don't think I've seen this movie. I don't know what it is. I don't think another one is going to help me, but... There's not Keanu Reeves. I, I don't I don't know, actually. Slow it down again. Can I recognize anybody in here? There was some bearded guy that... Kind of, I, I, I don't know. I really don't know. Almost famous. I'm going to be honest. I've never even heard of this. I feel like a lot of people are going to be upset with me that I've never seen this. Please forgive me. All right. Well, we, we had... Uh, I told you it's eventually going to get to a point to one I haven't seen. And there it is. You're feeling a little downtrodden, but that's okay. Iron Man. I am Iron Man. What? Could have sworn I saw him with the spark in his chest. It is Tom Robert Downey Jr. It's just another Avengers. I'm, I is I couldn't tell. Is it Avengers? Is it Civil War? I'm gonna say the Avengers. It is. Fudge. In other words, I'm making excuses. I'm a disgrace. Next. Okay, like come on, man. That ain't even fair. It's in Night Shyamalama Ding Dong's best movie, Avatar The Last Airbender. Whoops, I mean, James Cameron. Yeah, we're getting a sequel now, 28 years later. It's crazy. Three, two, one, lift off. Um, oh, uh, 50 First Dates? Uh, I want to say that was um, uh, the blonde haired girl. They're on a beach. I want to say 50 First Dates. 50 First Dates. Ooh, it's not. Okay. I'm still, I'm. Still sticking to the Adam Sandler, though. I think it's an Adam Sandler movie. I don't know. I didn't see Adam Sandler that time. Still tropical, though. There's somewhere... Uh, somebody had a, a, a lay, I believe, around their neck or head. I don't think I've ever seen it. Meryl Streep. Uh, is it Live, Love, Pray? Or what is this? Is Sisterhood of Traveling Pants? The Sisterhood of the Traveling Pants. Is it... Uh, what is it? Live, Eat, Love, Pray. Eat, Love, Eat, Live, Love. What the fudge? Eat. Pray love. No. Is it Mamma Mia? It might be Mamma Mia. Mamma Mia. But I honestly, it is. Pierce Bras. And how do I forget his name? Very easily, actually. Let me tell you. I can't remember the names of anybody. I, uh, that was in my mind for a second, but then I just like, how do you, what? Mamma Mia? Mia? Mom, Mom, oh, there was an A. I, I'm disappointed in myself. You guys deserve better. We go again. Three, two, one. Holy suck. Was that a baseball hat? Uh, I'm going to be honest. I didn't really see much. I got nothing. God, I wasn't paying attention. Hold on. No shot. No shot. Is that um everyone's favorite Christmas movie? I Hard? It is. Wow. I don't know what I saw in that first go. I was not in it to win it. I don't know where I saw a baseball helmet. No, yeah. I'm be interesting to see if you guys are like, well, I do that. Matrix. Okay. You know, I, I got to give it to him. And I feel like this this is might go over some people's head. That one was so easy. Simply, but like, watch, I guess I'm wrong. That was so easy because props to the director, the editor. They have such a strong and consistent visual theme. But not only theme, a color scheme and mood throughout that whole thing. Like, if I tell you Matrix Green... You immediately can picture it, can't you? And that's what I immediately saw. And I think that, like, that's a really strong visual motif that they managed to do and still do. And people can immediately recognize. So I think, you know, whoever was in charge of that, kudos, sir. Yeah, so I'm a big, I'm a big movie buff. I don't know. We're probably far enough in the video where random people probably clicked off by now. So gather around story time. I love me some movies. I love me some TV shows. Recently, in the past couple of years, have actually skewed towards TV shows because they've become so high quality and their ability to story tell over a longer form of content to make characters and stories go where normally you know a two two and a half hour movie can't so i actually pref i prefer a good show over a good movie simply because i like to i like to get lost in a movie or a show and the nice thing about a show is that you can do that for such a long uh, extended period of time and 
I feel like the more time I spend in the world, the more invested I get. Like Game of Thrones, for instance. If Game of Thrones was a two and a half hour movie, it would have been a banger movie. But it was eight seasons. And so it, you know, we don't talk about the last little stretch, but that's irrelevant. Always watched a bunch of movies and TV shows. And funnily enough, why is that? <laughs> because I'm depressed. Like, oh, okay, well, that was, that took a turn. Yeah, uh, I, if you don't already know, I have hereditary depression. Struggled with it. It especially really came to head, manifested, and I struggled with it since about seventh grade. And it's no coincidence that around seventh grade through high school, I watched so many movies and TV shows. So many. Simply because I was so tired, destitute, saddened, unmotivated, that I could not get myself to do anything except sit. And so while I was sitting, what would I do? I didn't have energy to do, mu to do much. And I didn't have energy to focus on many things. I had to really acquire... And I like needed for me to hyper focus on it. And so what else than to get lost in the world that I hate and hop into a movie? And so that's what I did. I watched an unholy amount of uh, movies, specifically around like eighth grade to uh, senior year. And so almost like 90% of the movies I've seen have come from that time period. So if I didn't watch it, then odds are might not be so good at watching or uh, guessing here. But that's the backstory. And I can actually kind of tell it's fun. It's a fun little game. Am I watching more movies and TV shows? I, it's almost like a, a graph and I can I can skew and, and I can track it with my depression. And it's like, ooh, watching more movies and TV shows? Yep, I'm more depressed. And sometimes I don't notice I'm doing it, but that's a sure sign because I get so tired. And guess what I've been doing more recently? Watching movies and TV shows. <laughs> <sighs> Anyway, I hope you guys are doing all okay. Check in with yourselves, check in with your friends, check in with your loved ones. You're okay. You're worth it. I love you. You're the best. You deserve everything. Sometimes things are a little rough, but next day is always better. And I know for me, I have to look forward to entertaining you folks. So speaking of which, let's see if I can recognize this movie. Uh, Freaky Friday? No, it is Lindsay Lohan. What else is Lindsay Lohan in? Play. Oh, 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 it has been a while. Um, I couldn't even tell you. It's not Parent Trap. Mean Girls? It might be Mean Girls. But that did not... I think I would have recognized Mean Girls. No idea. Let me go with Confessions of a Teenage Drama Queen. That wasn't it. All right. It was Mean Girls. What? Wow. That's a throw. That is not Fetch. Uh, yeah, if it's a football movie, the first one that comes to my mind is... No, but there's, I didn't see Sandra Bullock, but Bal Bal Bollocks? <laughs> uh, what, what was that one? The, 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 uh, fudge. I'm gonna go remember the Titans, y'all. No, okay. The fudge? I, I don't know. Okay, try again. I haven't seen this one, I don't think. It's, it's an older football movie. I don't know if I've seen it. Rudy. You guys are gonna hate me. I haven't seen Rudy. I'm sorry, Sean. Forgive me. It's going downhill. It's going down, downhill. <sighs> There's no shot. That was E.T., right? It was. Okay, we needed that. We needed a daub. Let's get it. I'm alone. Easy enough. I even saw the mom. Free. All right, that's two back-to-back. -back. We needed that. Wait, I was about to say Terminator, but there's poker in there. No, oh, wait, maybe I saw it wrong. Was it, is that James Bond? Was that, um, James Bond? Sky? Do I have to, like, specify? Because if I do, I'm Casino Royale. There's no shot at Casino, but. Huh? 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 That was a second of nothing, as far as I'm concerned. I couldn't tell you. I don't think I've seen it. So we're going to have to hope I recognize something or someone or... Still a movie I haven't seen. I, I got nothing. North by Northwest. I don't think I've heard of that. Okay, let's just go until I get another one. Go we have to end it on a high, high note. 
Perfect. You want to know what's crazy? Is I didn't have the best idea of what it was until the final shot. I don't know why I remember it so clearly, but I remember it ending right in front of that Las Vegas. Not, is that the Bellagio? I don't remember the name of it, but I do remember that shot because it's Ocean's Eleven. It's like my favorite heist movie. Uh, fun fact. If you haven't seen it, do yourself a favor and go do it. Okay, so now we'll do this poster doll thing again. Let me see if I can get one within the first 10 seconds, ideally. Because, like, tell me who in the world could see 20 pixels and be like, yep, I know what that is. Oh, 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 oh. It's an epic movie, I think. In Australia or something? Ah, oh, fudge. Ah, oh, shoot. I don't, I haven't seen it. No, I don't, I don't, I don't know it. Keep going. That's Tom Cruise. I'm going to be so confused. Oh, it's Hook. Okay. No, I was so far off. Okay. Never mind. Yep. Not even close. Okay. Maybe posters aren't my thing. Blue and purple. You know what? I'm just, let's just go right out there. Nice and early. Ghost Rider. What? More, whatever. Nope. Darn. Okay. Keep going. Keep going. It was a good try. It's a moon and some rocks. It's E.T. Dang it. Even see the guy in the air. Ah, I probably could have gotten that one earlier. Dang it, man. Um, that's ooh. What is that? Uh, the color scheme is speaking to me, but I don't. Tell me, what are you? Tell me. It's oh my god, oh my god, oh my god. Ah, uh, ooh. Ah, uh, the the title. It's isn't it Michael Sarah or something? Uh, the title is in like handwriting. It might be Napoleon Dynamite. Okay, we got that one in 10 seconds. I'll take it. I'll take it. The real question is, how did you guys do? Did you, did you, were you like, dude, that was, I outperformed you so hard. If so, fair play. Maybe I should go back. Here's a question. Of those that I said I hadn't seen, movie-wise, which one would you recommend I see out of those couple that I mentioned? You know, like, would you say like, oh, well, Rudy, Rudy would be the one, or, you know, Casablanca or one of those. Let me know, American Dream. That was the name of that one, right? Anyway, I hope you guys enjoyed this. I know this was a little bit different. But I thought it'd be a little fun mix-up. Hey, variety, baby. That's the channel. And that's the spice of life.